Okay, today is a labor day. And we want to look at the objective of coming. Now, sometimes many people are very confused with the objective. Now, let us look at the objective of comment. We leave them out, we explain them so so well to understand that each time a question is being placed before you, like I can remember very well um, during 2018, 2019, Bamenda Mok, there was a question that they asked about the objective of comment. That was for Cameroon. If you are watching me out of Cameroon, you know that the objective of comment are as follows. Actually, one of the objectives, we are talking about the, the importance of comment, that our comment has really laid it out. The importance. Now, first of all, one of the importance is that common comments um, promote the transfer of both oral and written communication. That is, it, it promotes the, 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 the the message to, to live from one area to another. This message can either be oral or written. Now, another importance of comment is that it helps to transport goods and services or goods from area of surplus to area of what? To area of scarcity. Let's say in, in talking about, we're talking about the H2 trade, where we talk about that comment actually in a transport um, um, position, comment actually um, facilitate the transportation of what of goods and services. Now, it is important because it transfers these goods and services from area of surplus. Now, for example, let's take the case of those who import um, cars from America, cars from England to Cameroon. You know, the cars are actually excess in that area. There are excess cars there, so people will buy it from area of um, um, excess and then transport it to Cameroon where they, they are actually no they are not actually many cars here. Let's use another example like we can talk about the case of, 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 of petrol in Sonaral in Bimbe. In Sonaral there's a lot of petrol there. So comment also actually help in what in transporting this petrol from where from um Limbe where to Juala. Now, commerce also helps to facilitate the exchange of goods and services, which all people over nations enjoy, whether within or outside the country. Now, it also helps do what? Facilitate the exchange of goods and services. Then we are talking about trade. Now, trade there, we have already made mention of um, talking about you can export goods. Now, you can export a good, let's say from um, um, America, like things like apples that have been export, um, exported from, from America, some other countries to our own country to facilitate that exportation of all those transfer of goods and services from one area, like the area of lacking, um, the area of surplus to the area of, of lacking or the area of scarcity. Now, comment also encourage friendship relationship between nations because of socialization. Now, comment helps in, um, in, um, in um, friendship or creating friendship, this is as a result of what of trade. Now, let's say, for example, I am in Cameroon and I'm trading with a country like um, Nigeria. Now, when I'm trading with Nigeria, actually, I'm creating a friendship. Or if I'm saying, if I just have to say I'm in um, United, the United States of America, and then I'm communicating with someone who is in UK. It is actually we are creating friendship because we cannot be um, enemies and we are trading. So comments also help us in the world in carrying out trade and making us to come up with creating our friendship and relationships between countries or between uh, nations or between within a nation. Now comments also helps to extend commercial activities depending on the standards of living of the nation. Now comments also actually increase the standard of of living in, in our country. Let's say, for example, we you were, being, you were carrying out things like trade. Let's say, for example, a, uh, um, an individual carrying out trade. Now, when he's carrying out this trade, he must do what? He must employ people to come and do what? To come and work under him or to work for him. So when they work under him or work for him, actually, they will pay them. And when they give them income, it also does what? It, um, it, it generates or increases the standard of living. Or comments can also help in increasing the standard of living 
to um, countries which we have, um, let's say, for example, countries which are producing food stock where it will not be, let's say, for example, in Africa, Africa will supply um, African food stock in countries like America, Germany, and other nations that will also help the world to increase the standard of living of those nations. Comments also bridge the gap between time of um, production and time of future consumption. Now, in, in this, um, he's trying to talk about the distribution of goods and services. Let's say, for example, a good was being produced and stored here in Cameroon, and then sometime, let's say, in the nearest future, it is needed, let's say, in America. So it actually reduces that, that gap to distribute that goods at a very easy time. Let's say, for example, things like Janga, where it is sometimes people usually buy it from Cameroon and then export it to other nations. You can buy, you can um, 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 do, um, you see, you can sort of catch them from, from waters or you, you go bring them from waters, you sun them, and then you store them. Now, let's say, for example, there is meat. You can now produce out and then sell it and sell to other nations. So, comment is very, very important. It also helps to protect against risk. That is as a result of injury. Comment actually helps in protecting us against risk. It makes people to not to be afraid of doing business. So comment is a very important part. It has good objectives. It is very important to the economic as a whole. It also helps in creating friendship and like when we talk about international trade when we study it, when we study fully and transport in comment and we also look at um, things like um, insurance is a good topic. We talk about consular retailers is a good topic. When we be looking at that, you get to understand all the importance of comment. Now let us move to the next. Now we are talking about factors promoting the growth of comment in Cameroon. Which are those factors that can actually promote this comment to grow very fast or factors, things that can make comment grow very fast. Now first of all we have the growth of postcard services in Cameroon. These postcard services help to to um, <coughs> to promote comments in Cameroon. We also have the availability of insurance houses to protect against it. These are some of the factors that promote the growth of, of comments. Let's say, for example, a, an individual who was afraid to carry out any fixable uh, business. Now, as a result of the introduction of um, the insurance company, we could indemnify it in terms of any um, risk of, or any problem. It will actually promote this individual to carry out what comments. Comment also another factor in that it improve the improvement in the transport and, com and communication. This is another factor that also promotes the growth of comment. Now, promoting this growth of comment is as a result of when the transport the transport areas are very good, where goods and services can easily leave, let's say Douala, Bamenda, to other areas, and then there are com there's communication between the partners who are carrying out the business. You see that comments will grow. Very, very well. <clears throat> Another top, um, promotion which is um, internet services which encourage e commerce. Now, in this e commerce, we are talking about these internet services. You can talk about some of us who carry, or carry out trade in platforms like YouTube, some of us who carry out trade in platforms like Facebook, who advertise our product online on other social media platforms. So, comments also promote this. So it is also um, a good award of comment. And another is the improvement in the advertisement of trade and production community. You know, as a result of, uh, of um, this, this improvement in the advertisement system, where there are modern system of advertisement groups, where we have modern systems like um, the, 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 the media, where we talk about the social media, we can um, provide things like Facebook, we can talk about Instagram, so it actually the needs of um, social media platform is actually advertised products. We can also do um, normal advertising where we meet day to day where some schools actually meet with um, when we talk about advertising where schools will meet face and um, 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 schools will meet with parents to advertise or students to advertise their products, to advertise the schools to talk about more about their educational system. And then there are also advertisements where they can give up paper posted on other areas where they can actually create awareness about the, 
existing to either school or a tutor. So that is also some of the factors. Those are some of the factors that actually led to the global conflict. Okay, now we are talking about some of the factors that are hindering the growth of comments. Some of those things that actually can make comments not to go so far. Now, first of all, we'll talk about one of them is inadequate access. There are some people who, who will not carry out business transaction, not as a result of that they don't want to carry it, but as a result of that they lack the finance, they lack the capital to carry out this business transaction. So this is one of the reasons that actually um, hinder the growth of, of commerce. There is also poverty. As a result of poverty, especially in um, Cameroon, some people have low purchasing power. So as a result of this low purchasing power, we also do what? Hinder the growth of commerce. Let's say, for example, someone who is doing the business of, of, of carrying out goods and services, like sales of goods and services. Now, if there is no income to purchase these goods and services, you see that these comments will not actually go into reality. People will not actually do the comments because there are not people who are available to do or to buy these goods and services. So the people who carry out this business will not actually carry out it effectively. And then we also have poor transport and communication system. Especially in um, some countries in West Africa, there are poor transport, poor communication system, which also hinder the growth of all of communities. Let's say, for example, talking about some cities like countries like Cameroon, the Cameroon um, and transport system is very poor, it's very, very bad. There are some areas that before you go into the interior to to put to um, advertise your product or to serve your product, you have to spend more. Where at this poor transport facilities also hinder that companies to go to the interior to advertise and to sell you their product. So it is also a hindrance to what to the growth of commerce in the country or into the interiors. Now we have um, advanced freeport or popular known of coming. This um, scamming has also hindered the growth of commerce because many people are afraid of, of, of buying goods, especially from, from, from Facebook, on social media platforms like the e um, platform. This part of coming, you know, it has, it has been a notice, especially in Africa, where African countries, most African countries are involved in um, scamming to scam maybe the wife to get easy money. So as a result of this coming, um, many um, individuals are afraid to purchase goods online because they think that they can be fooled for their for the goods that they pay. They can pay. They think that sometimes if they pay for these goods, they will not receive the goods at their doorstep. So as a result of that, it also do what it also hinder the growth of what of commerce in Cameroon. There's also low level of what of investment. People are not willing to invest, even when um, um, proposed business ideas are being um, shown to them. Some people are, are not willing to invest. Some of them are not willing to invest, not because they are afraid to invest. Some of them are, are not willing to invest because they fear, some of them fear um, um, the growth of, um, they fear scam. There are some businesses that can come into, in, into existence where you could invest and get money in the long run. But because you fear that you can be scammed for that business, you see that some many individuals will be afraid to, to involve in these businesses and then they will, they will, reduce, they will refuse to do or to invest. So the low level of investment also does what in that the growth of comments in countries around the world. And then there's also high taxes. You know, uh, some countries, especially countries like Cameroon, have high taxes on the, the goods and services, especially goods which are coming into the country. They will levy high taxes on these goods and services. It will make the individuals who buy these goods to sell to, 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 find, to find a consumer to pay high, um, 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 high prices. So as a result of these high taxes that are being levied on goods and services, it also in that what the growth of commerce in Cameroon. And then there's also low level of what of saving. Low level of saving also hinder the growth of commerce. That's one factor also that hinder the growth of commerce. Many people sometimes are not um, willing to invest 
in businesses or many people are not willing to to, to save rather wow. many people are not willing to save so to when they they, they, they are not willing to save money um, for further investment it also hinder wow. the growth of our of public income as well dear viewers we can thank you for watching our videos on benjamin academics hope you enjoy the video and hope to see you if you are watching us for the very first time the subscription button you just press the subscription button you subscribe and turn on the bell to be notified each time we have a video on youtube and on our various social media platforms like facebook twitter instagram and all other social media platforms to get our numbers on our facebook page you can contact us on there you can either write us on our facebook page you can also write us on our um, you can also write on our comment box on our YouTube channel. We hope to see you. Bye-bye.